I want to appreciate God for giving me this great opportunity to witness the 60th birthday of our great nation, Nigeria. Nigeria at 60, bless the name of the Lord. I want to encourage us as children of God that we should be prayerful, we should be hopeful, we should keep hope alive concerning Nigeria. We went out this morning and uh, we could see that majority of people are not happy about Nigeria, but we encouraged them. But for me, I believe Nigeria is going to be better. Nigeria is going to be great. There is hope concerning Nigeria. An end has come to poverty. Today is October 1, Nigeria Independence Day. Nigeria is 60. There are so many people saying so many things negative about Nigeria. They are saying, is there hope for Nigeria? The Bible says if a fig tree is cut down at the spot of water, it will, it will spring up fruits again. I believe there is hope for Nigeria. Despite the harsh economic condition that we have around, despite the negative statistical information that is telling us that can Nigeria ever make it, despite the downcasting statement of everybody, can we do, can Nigeria be great again? I believe Nigeria can be great because our God can do many things. He that is able to do abundantly well can restore Nigeria. Our economy can be back on its feet. We can have good leaders. Just let us pray. Let's keep hope alive. Let's keep on doing the right thing. Let's keep on work, working on Nigeria and Nigeria shall be great again. Happy Independence Day, Nigeria. Regardless of what people see about this country, I will make it. You also should believe. Keep hope alive. Happy anniversary, Nigeria! Happy 60th Independence Day, Nigeria! Happy Independence Day, Nigeria. It's the 60th anniversary of Nigeria. I'm glad to be alive. I hope you are glad to be alive. Um, Island Church is celebrating Nigeria today, and I am celebrating Nigeria. It's such a privilege to be alive today. Praise God. Bless God. Keep the hope alive. Don't give up. Don't lose hope. Pastor has said, after COVID-19, is honor. I'm honored, and you are honored in Jesus' name.